Lesson 32 in Theory of Road Vehicle Motion. This is a quick video on how I imagined the assignment for this course. What are the things you need to do and what will you get from this assignment? This assignment is done by yourself and if you do it or not doesn't really affect the fact that you finished this course and learned a little bit. It is made so you understand the concepts of transmission, resistances to motion a little bit deeper. I made a PDF file that is called Assignment Manual. It has 25 pages and if I see that people who are enrolled in the course are taking a big interest in the assignment, I will add more material to it over time. The PDF is going to guide you through the entire process of analyzing and calculating various parameters of the vehicle. In its first version, we are going to input the base parameters, we are going to calculate the resistances to motion that the vehicle has, and we are going to plot the tractive forces and try to read maximum speeds for the vehicle. Now, you're asking yourself, why didn't he make a video on this? Well, it would actually take me less time to create a video, but I wanted to make something that is more challenging and engaging. So I wrote this tiny guide. If I just showed it on video, you would copy it and the stuff you would do would not stick too much. This way, you have more time to reflect on the information that you've gathered, calculated, and I think this is a better way to do this. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm right, only time will tell. This is the first time I incorporated such an assignment in one of my courses. What will you need for this assignment? Well, first off, you will need some free time. Depending on the knowledge you have on Microsoft Excel or a similar software, the assignment can take up around two hours of your time. This can be more or less depending on the way your tempo is. There really isn't a time limit on doing the assignment. Just go over the manual thoroughly and try to learn as much as you can. You will need the PDFs that I've supplied in the resource part of this lesson. There's a total of eight PDF files and you will need Microsoft Excel or a similar spreadsheet software and of course, knowledge how to use this software. The PDFs that I've supplied are the following. You have the assignment manual, the continental tire catalog, and one car specification PDF that I left for you to choose. You can choose between these six cars, which one you want to analyze. If you want to use another car that you fancy you can, uh, just make sure you have all of the information that you have on these cars and these PDFs, because this information is crucial for the assignment. This is it. The next step for you is to download all of the resources that you have in this lesson and get to work. Thank you for listening and for staying focused and good luck.